My name is Magdalene Kaite. I come from Kenya, from the Maasai community. Uh, I'm happy to be here. I uh, work for Hemayan Integrated Development Organization. Um, why I'm here is that uh, I represent my community and I represent my country. Our cause is fighting for nature and environmental issues that we are grappling with as a country. And our objective is to restore, to restore environment within our own country and also appealing to the nations of the world to do the same, the countries, the locals, and the communities. As, a, as an individual, I feel that this is a worthy cause because the world does not belong to only us, but also to us and the future generation. We need to restore the balance between human beings and other creatures within, uh, within nature because uh, the world was perfect before when it was handed to us at creation. But because of our own selfish interventions, we be, we've been able to destroy nature and destroy uh, biodiversity. But I believe we can be able to consciously uh, make peace with the world and ensure that the world is a better place for us and all biodiversity and the future generations. And uh, maybe linking up to our work in Kenya, the government is working so hard to restore Mao forest. And currently, some of the success stories that we have is that we are working with children to restore the great Mao complex. Uh, we are introducing woodlots in schools. We are uh, planting the bamboo seedlings across the Mao forest so that we can ensure that we have restored Mao forest to its former glory. And ideally, uh, we would love to see that all the communities living downstream and upstream enjoy their source of water and get their regular uh, livelihoods from, from the Mao forest, which is not the case right now. So we are carrying out corrective measures, and we are doing this uh, through collective action by all stakeholders, the community members, the children, the government, and all partners working together. So this is one of the success story. We, mob we mobilize children, we provide them with seedlings, and we ensure that they plant seedlings, tree seedlings within their schools and within the Mao forest. So I, uh, we, we are telling the entire world, let us embrace conservation across the board as human beings, and our world will never be the same again. Thank you very much.